What's up dudes and welcome back to another exciting episode of Fishing More Outdoors. As you guys can maybe see, we are in a beautiful, uh, I'll show you guys in a second, but we're actually in a freaking crazy permanent fish house. We're located on Leech Lake and as you can maybe see down below, uh, we're going to be targeting some burbot in this episode. I am really freaking jacked. I haven't I haven't targeted burbot yet this year. But as always, dudes, I'm gonna try to keep this intro nice and short. We have a, we're gonna have a long day and night ahead of us. I'm alone right now, but we do have four friends coming to fish with us tonight. Uh, you guys probably already seen Brett. My cousin Brett was with me, but. He already took off to go do some fishing. And then Nick, Marshall Outdoors, you guys all know Nick. He's gonna be, he's gonna be here in like a half an hour. And then we have two super secret uh, friends coming all the way from another state. I'm gonna keep it a secret for now. But they're gonna be pulling up at like seven, eight o'clock a little bit later tonight. But anyways, guys, this episode is sponsored by Trapper's Landing. We are so fortunate to be able to stay in this crazy freaking luxury fish house i'll show you once again i'll give you a little i'll give you a little tour in just a second this house is crazy this is like the biggest house i've personally ever fished in but anyways dudes if any of y'all are ever coming up to leech lake minnesota y'all have to check out trapper's landing whether it's winter or summer they have like crazy nice cabins they got freaking just an all-around awesome resort and really awesome people even if you guys are coming just for like a day trip or something and you, and you don't need to rent like a permanent or a cabin like that they also also have some really awesome guides to uh, put you on some really good fish. But anyways, let's uh, go ahead and get right into the tour. You guys are gonna lose it. This house is insane. As you walk in the front door, right over here to the left, we have a big old table and this table uh, collapses and that's basically just a huge bed. And when I say huge, I mean huge. This is like a, this is like bigger than my bed at home. I mean, if you collapse this table, it's, it's, this is a huge bed. Got another little pull down bed right there. We got some storage up here. Looks like my cousin Brett already has some of his stuff up here. Right next to the table, we got three holes here with obviously we got some we got some rattle reels going. Those will definitely be a player once uh, we go to bed and whatnot. Then once you come over here, right on the other side of the table, look at this guys. Two big old recliner leather chairs. Come over here, big heater. We got uh, nice countertops for cooking and whatnot. We got the stove and oven. Uh, come over here, we got a big old, that's gotta be like a 40 inch TV. That's a big old TV. Pretty sure he mentioned that we could watch Netflix and stuff with that TV too. So that's freaking sweet. Next to the TV, we have a huge couch that also pulls out into a bed. That's crazy. Another bunk right here that pulls out. And then right here, this is probably my favorite part. Oh my God, this is awesome. Look at, okay, it's got an underwater camera already hooked up. What's that? Is that a perch? <laughs> is that a jumbo perch just waiting to get caught? That's freaking crazy. I'm just filming and there's just a perch sitting on the aqua view. <laughs> oh, Look what the cat dragged in. Holy cats. Dude, how nuts is this house right now? This is intense. <laughs> wow. Gonna be a good day. Take the captain's chair tonight. No, Call you can older. just get up right now because no, no. that's our. Dude, I just had my camera set up. But that's my chair. No, hey, that's my chair. That's your chair. Nick's, Nick's here, guys. We can do that. <laughs> this is sick. Yeah. Well, I'm pumped. Alright, good luck. Call right, me for yeah. snap. Yeah, send me anything you catch. Big or small. Okay. <laughs> Alright, Nick took off to go catch some daytime burbits. I have to uh, unpack a bunch of stuff, and I'm pretty infatuated with the underwater camera right now, so pretty determined to catch a fish on it. I also did, I set up a big camera right here so that hopefully you guys can watch the underwater footage. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, big camera on. Oh, it's kind of crooked, but that's a good one. Come on, come on. There's so many perch. I, I don't, they don't look that big though, but for those of you that have used underwater cameras, you can't really tell until you catch one. Okay, 
I am done messing with those perch for now. I'm gonna get all my, I'm, I'm just gonna get all my stuff kind of organized. We're gonna be out here for three nights, or two nights, three days, so. I'm gonna get all my stuff organized, just kind of get ready. I might, I might get something to eat too. And, uh, yeah, I'm probably just gonna break out the camera again once we, uh, start jigging up some burbot, or if I see a burbot on the underwater camera, I'll pull it out, or something like that. Two hours later. Oh my god. GoPro, start recording. Oh. Hold on. 20 minutes later. Time check. It is 7.14 and about 20 minutes ago we just had our first official burbot sighting. I'm pretty sure, no, it was for sure a burbot. You can pretty well tell a burbot mark from any other fish. It's like a big blob weird, their tail does a weird thing that you can just kind of tell that it's a burbot. But we officially marked a burbot. I got a Snapchat from my cousin Brett. He caught a burbot, so it's time. It's time to catch a burbot, and I need to change the battery in this. A little longer than a few minutes later. Burbot, he's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. <laughs> I don't think it's very big. <laughs> I lost him at the hole. I forgot I'm only fishing 16 feet and he popped up at, at my hole, but I don't think it was very big, but that still sucks! Oh my god! For sure burbot. Crappy hook set. I wasn't ready. Drag was not set. Oh my god, dudes. Good sign though. That's pretty cool. Oh my god, okay. Little update dudes. Reddy's back, Nick's back, and we are going to pick up the final two surprise guests of the trip. You guys are going to be pumped. One second. Terrifying. The surprise guest. You're filming and I'm filming. <laughs> we're, we're vloggers. Vloggers. <laughs> What's up, dude? Um, I'm scared. Yeah, I know. That's why I came and got you. Okay, that's so nice of you. He said he wasn't. First he said he was going to come and get me, and then he said he wasn't. I was going to just like FaceTime. <laughs> I was going to yeah. give you directions via FaceTime. But okay, that'll work. I'm blind. It's dark. Yeah, I'm blind too. All right, let's go. Let's go. We got like a two-minute drive. Okay, deal. Josh and Boo are here from Nebraska. Let's go. The next day. Josh, what are we doing? Uh, well, we're not catching very many fish, but... No. The house sure is nice. Yeah, we haven't done much filming. It's the next day, by the way. We haven't done much filming since last night. Uh, kind of been sucking it up. Last night we missed two fish at the hole. Two birds, one at the hole, one. Give him a hook set. Yep, it just came. Ah! Boo! Oh my God, I got oh. Boo, boo, are you okay? What? Boo, He's move so your high. foot. No, he came off. Oh my God. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> what just happened? Oh my god! Is that what you did? I just I'm gonna pee my pants. Movie pole. I think I peed a little. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. And uh, we also went and did some fishing this morning and stuff, and we just didn't do much filming and didn't do very well. But now, just giving you a little update, we are freaking cooking something bomb. Okay, once again, what are we cooking? Shrimp. Cajun shrimp Alfredo. What? With noodles with a whole stick of butter. Let's go. We aren't trying to be healthy out here. And then we got salmon. I should pull it out and like show I it. I can't to see. Them. No, I'll, I'll 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 show a plate. I'll show my plate or something. But yeah, that's what we got going on. Little game plan. We are going to. We went fishing for like four, three, four hours. We didn't. Maybe five. Yeah, maybe five hours. We didn't do much fishing. Look at you. You're an animal. He's eating noodles with his fingers. Anyways, uh, our game plan. We are going to eat supper slash lunch, and then we're going to not burbot fish in the house tonight we're actually gonna go hole hopping where uh brett and nick went and fished last night they ended up catching like four i don't know if i told you guys that but yeah we're gonna go hole hopping tonight so that's the game plan hopefully y'all are enjoying the video so far and yeah
Stay tuned. One more thing, dudes. I forgot to show y'all this. Fresh Fish and More merch for all the Canadian viewers. Look at that. Tim Hortons. Link in description. It's like the sickest merch I've ever made. Check this out. Holy buckets. Josh. What up? You're a god. I like cooking. This looks freaking insane. <clears throat> this is probably the most gourmet thing I've ever had in a fish house. 100%. Well, I don't know. I came prepared. I spent like $100 at high V before I came here. All right. I'm going to absolutely plow this, and then we're probably... <laughs> Can I join? <laughs> okay, calm down. Okay, I'm going to absolutely plow this, and then we'll probably just see you. Oh, bourbon fishing. Little update, guys. Josh, what happened? I'm going to answer for you, okay? We suck. <laughs> <laughs> After we ate that delicious uh, salmon and shrimp pasta, we all fell asleep until now. And it's dark out, as you can see. So I don't think we are going to go hole hopping anymore. Instead, I think we're just going to remain being comfy. Because why wouldn't we remain being comfy? And why would we even want to leave this fish house? Because it's so nice. We're going to hang out here and try to catch a burbot out of the house. We have to catch at least one bourbon out of this thing so stay tuned dudes we don't have a lot of minnows either so, zero to be exact zero <laughs> <laughs> stay tuned are Doesn't you really freaking serious big, though, but it is oh my god it's peeling Did... let him let him peel or just a damn let him pool peel pool <laughs> there he is it's oh. it's just a little baby should i just boat flip his ass yeah you probably can <gasps> Get him, Josh. I'm gonna... No. No. Uh. He backed oh, down. He's no, he's stuck right in there. The hole. He's stuck in the hole sideways. No oh way. Gosh, <laughs> he's fatter. It's hey, grab this broom. Hey, light. Grab the broom. I'm gonna try to snag him. <laughs> no, try to snag him. I snagged him. <gasps> no, you didn't. Yes, I did. Are you pranking him? <laughs> <laughs> oh my bar. god. Uh, sorry guys, we don't promote snagging. No, we don't. Clearly. <laughs> Unless you lose him in the hole. Technically, we probably had to do that because he was stuck in the hole. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Boo, what the f***, man? <laughs> Legend. You want me to hold him? Yeah. I'm so happy. <laughs> I got too excited. No rats. Let's go! I feel like that's bullshit because I feel like if the glow matters, they have to be at Dude, least able like to bullshit. see a little bit. Dude. Are you serious? Nice, that thing came out of nowhere. Are you serious? Hold on, I gotta try to get this out of here. Are you recording? I am recording. I'm not. Dude, he was just on me. <laughs> Dude, no way. I caught a bird! I was recording for the hook set. It! Well, we ain't caught it yet. No, You're I in the damn it. panty hole. I caught it. What pound test is this? Because he's getting flipped. 15 pound. That is the smallest bird that I've ever caught in my life. That's kind of cool, he though. It's awesome, though. Look at that little turd. Cute yeah, little guy. Like... <sighs> Dude, that thing came... Did you just... Your rod tip just, like, bam. Yeah, I looked down, and my, my rod was going like this. <laughs> so he was just on there, right? I sent him to the moon. Oh, I saw it. It's like a little... He's got a little love spot. <gasps> no! <laughs> it hit me in the d***. <laughs> Graceful. Graceful. Hey, that was yeah, actually that was graceful. Again. Not too... Pretty shitty. Yeah, let me smell your hands. Slime time. Slime it up. They don't really smell like catfish. They have their own nasty stink. They don't really smell that bad. No oh, way. It is a fish. It's got to be a burbot. It's a burbot. Is it? Yes. Have you seen it? It's fighting weird. It's a burbot. It's a burbot. It's another a burbot. Yep. It's another fairy. Let's go. What the fuck? Oh, dang, it is. <laughs> the next morning all right guys as you can see the house is nice and clean again we are heading out uh one more time i'd love to give a huge shout out right here to trapper's landing once again if y'all are ever in the leech lake area y'all have to hit up our buddy josh these houses are 
absolutely insane. 100% the biggest ice fish house I've ever been in. But yeah, this video is probably, hold on, this video is probably going to be all over the place. Uh, I, I'm making a video from like three nights of being out here, so yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and uh, at least we did catch four burbot. We didn't get absolutely skunked out here, so that's cool. But yeah, huge shout out Trappers, huge shout out Josh and Boo. If you guys haven't seen their channels before, I'll link them down below. They make YouTube videos also. And I uh, guess all that's left to say, dudes. Oh yeah, one more thing. New Fish and More merch for all the Canadians and Americans. This is low-key the dopest merch I've ever came out with. Like, seriously, this is awesome. I love Tim Horton. So, yeah, I'll link that down below. Go check that out. And I guess all that's left to say, dudes. You guys are fishing more. Uh, we're gonna go give Burbit another try also tonight. So, hopefully stay tuned for another Burbit video. We'll see ya. We'll see you next time. I deserve